Uh, welcome to the uh, deck rail. Uh, how about deck rail advanced video? Deck rail advanced video. Uh, I can't think of anything else. Anyway, you know, build a deck. And I don't like the hand. I mean, oh, handrails look good. I guess they look good. But I want something different. I want something different. That's not the kind of handrail I like. So, so what am I going to do? How do I do this? I think this is one way I like to do this. You, I'm going to build my own handrail. And I'm going to build it out of moldings, uh, 2D moldings. Okay, so you, I'm going to change this to, uh, I think I'm going to change it to one inch. And uh, it's going to be invisible. Now, watch what happens when I, when I make it invisible. It, it shows a d dash line, right? I made it very thin. But, but once it goes invisible, it goes on its own layer. But though so I really like to go, I go you. And because I would like this to show on different layers and stuff, uh, layer, uh, uh, I want to be on walls normal. Walls, where is it? Walls normal. Right there. Define, copy, walls normal. Deck, and and this is just I just know what this is, and it's going to be a solid line. So I just put it on a solid, and, and so so I've now got the edge of my deck showing. See that? And when you turn your line weights on, it all just, all but dis. Well, not really, not very good, does it? One, two, three. You. How about make it uh, make make it make it? Uh, I don't know. One one sixteenth inch thick. Is that better? Yeah. Now it's just a. Now it's just a line. And that represents the end of my deck. Now I want to do a handrail, and I got to be, be quite frankly, I'm not the smartest uh, knife in the, in, the, in, the, in the butcher block. And because I, you know, I've done these stupid railing videos forever and a day, and I, I keep, I keep learning something from it. I don't know what, I don't know why I just created. Uh, what is that? Uh, one, two, uh, three. Oh, where's my, where's my? Uh, Tab, tab. I don't know. I lost it. My, 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 my railing. Well, I'm gonna make it out of a molding. This is gonna be my railing made out of a molding. Okay. The deck is at uh, U is at uh, zero height. Perfect. Cancel. So this is my deck railing, and I'm just gonna completely build this thing out of my own stuff. Okay. So I'm gonna turn it into a two two D molding. Uh, molding. And I'm going to add a uh, molding to it. Add new. Add new. I'm going to go into my own little thing. Add new, you nitwit. <laughs> User catalog. Uh, my moldings. And I like to, I just have a bunch of rectangular moldings right here. This one right here, uh, it's uh, 1.5 because it's going to be a 2 by. It's going to be a 2 by uh, 3.5. And it's 42 inches to the top, okay? Cancel. Okay. And that looks good to me. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm just drag it over to here and drag it over to here. All right. Nice. Nice. And it lines up with the edge of the deck. And we can start messing around with other things, I, I think, if we want. But let's kind of keep building. Let's just keep building this railing. Now I want to go uh, you, and I want to build a, I want to add another molding. And this is going to be molding number two because this is my bottom rail. Okay, the height is going to be 1.5 inches, the width is going to be 3.5 still, and it's going to be 4 inches vertical to the bottom. Now I'm going to add another railing, another molding, add new. This is going to be molding number 3. This is going to be 3.5 inches tall, 1.5 inches thick, and it's going to be because this is going to be a, a vertical rail right underneath the top rail. And so to the top, it's going to be 42 minus 1 and a half is 42, 41, 40.5. 1 and a half, 1 and a half is 3. Perfect. Okay. Now that's going to be the outside rail. Now I'm going to add another molding. This is going to be molding number 4. And I'm going to show you which where number 4 is going to go. Well, height is going to be... 3.5. It's going to be 1.5 inches thick. It's going to be raised up off the bottom. The bottom's going to be raised up 4 inches, but this time it's going to be offset uh, 1.5, 2.5 inches. Now let's see what we've got. That's exactly what I wanted. 
Because, see, I, that's really number four, I think. That's that vertical right there. And that's on the inside of that 2 by 4 bottom rail. And this is, can I uh, give these different colors? Give me a second. Uh, library. Did I start my timer? Yeah, four, four minutes left. Perfect. Uh, to, uh, library. Uh, make this smaller. I want to go to materials. Materials, materials, materials. Find them. Uh, materials, colors, uh, no, uh, color palettes. That's going to be, oops, component. That's going to be red. That's going to be, that's going to be red. This is going to be uh, green. This is going to be yellow. And this one's, this one's going to be blue. Okay? Now, I understand that these are flush right here, and I could play around with that if I want. But now I want to add some verticals, okay? So you, so now I come in here and I add another molding. One, two, three, four, I add another molding. You add new. Molding number five. And I just do this just so I can keep track of which is which. Uh, the height is going to be uh, uh, I know it's going to be. I know it's going to be um, um, forty-two, forty point five to the top. It's going to be inset one point five inches, and it's going to be one inch wide. Oh boy! Uh oh, I'm in trouble already. This ain't gonna work. Is it gonna work? No, this isn't gonna work. I'm adding my pickets. That's what I'm doing. I'm adding my pickets now. Cancel. Okay, I'm glad I did this. I'm glad I did this. Here we go. I, I want to add a picket. Okay, so open uh, new. I'm gonna create a picket right here. P. Right there, I've got to zoom in real close. These pickets are going to be one by one. Oh, man. There. So, one. One. I'm going to turn this into a solid. I've got to think about this. Uh, 42 minus uh, 39, 35 inches tall. Perfect. Okay, so this polyline solid, okay, zero, 35 inches tall, okay, and I'm going to give it a uh, color of uh, U material birch, plan B, I, uh, birch 3 is fine. Just a different material, that's all I need. Now I'm going to do an H view. Now I'm going to turn this into a symbol. And it's going to be a molding. Molding, not millwork. Uh, should it be millwork? I think it has to be molding. Okay. Rail, picket. One by one molding. Okay, and now it's in my it's in my library. Computers yeah, I guess so. So now I come back to here. You molding. Add new molding. Timer done. I should have rail pick it one by one molding. Right there. It ain't what I wanted. I might have to come back and do this. I'm always learning. Never know enough.
the height is 35 inches. Uh, I want it to be 35, 42, 40, 40. Point five to the top, and it's got to be inset one inch. I uh, know one point five. Let's see what I get. It's solid. See, I thought I could. I thought I could put spacing on that. I th I thought I could space it. I thought I just saw this recently where I. Uh, okay, I I'm done with part one. Done with part one. 